It's 1979, and Freddie Acklam stands in a long, snaking line at the Sudanese foreign ministry. Sweat pours down his face, not only because of the heat, but because of the danger of what he must do. As he approaches the front of the line, he recoils in terror, pointing to the corner of the room and yelling, Rat! Rat! The office breaks into chaos as people scatter, fleeing the non-existent rodent. In the confusion, he slips from the room along with his partner, Danny Lamore, and as they exit, Lamore whispers, Got it. Freddy Akloom has just orchestrated the acquisition of an official Sudanese foreign ministry seal, the key to his people's freedom. This is the story of Freddy Akloom, hero of the Jewish people, Moses to the Beta Israel, Mossad agent, and badass Jew. Freddy Akloom is born on May 15, 1949, in the Tigray region of Ethiopia, and is a member of the Beta Israel, or Ethiopian Jewish community. Despite being a reluctant student, he graduates from Teachers College and begins opening Jewish schools around Ethiopia. In 1977, he works with the legendary Yona Begale to move 120 Beta Israel to Addis Ababa for Aliyah, an act that puts him on the radar of Ethiopia's brutal dictator Mengistu. With a price on his head, Ferede sneaks hundreds of miles from his home to Sudan, out of the reach of Mengistu, but still unsafe for Jews. He risks contacting the Jewish community abroad, but rather than a ticket to Israel, they send Mossad agent Danny Lamour. Akloum and Lamour search the refugee camps in Sudan for hidden Jews. Akloum goes places where Lamour's light skin does not allow. This is dangerous work, and though hunted, harassed, shot at, and imprisoned, they succeed in smuggling out over 900 Jews. In September of 1980, his cover is blown and he is snuck out of the country posing as a tuberculosis patient, coughing up a lung until safely in the air. Freddy lives out his days in Israel, never giving up the fight for the Jews of Ethiopia. An inspiration to his Jewish family around the world, Freddy Akloum, badass Jew.